the seed that fell on stony places. Continuing with his parable, our Lord said that the second batch of seeds fell on stony places. Our Lord said some fell on stony places where they did not have much earth and they immediately sprang up because they had no depth of earth. But when the sun was up, they were scorched, and because they had no root, they withered away. A field must have plentiful soil. Seeds fall on stony places, cannot take roots deep in the ground because of the stones, and will ultimately wither away in no time for the buds cannot be nourished by their roots. Therefore, what our Lord found problematic with the second field is stones. The stones that were in this field were great obstacles for the seeds to grow. Those of us who do not recognize they were the seeds of evil doers will all end up like this. When the seed of life is sown in the field of our hearts, we must accept the word of God, acknowledge the truthfulness of this word, and thereby be saved from all our sins. However, that the seeds fell on stony places mean that the gospel of the water and the spirit fell on the hearts of those who are filled with their own carnal thoughts. This passage tells us that what leads our souls to death is our carnal thought that prevent the word of God from planting its roots deep into our hearts. Therefore, as there is no depth of earth, they end up withering away. It is difficult for you and I to reach an understanding of our fundamental nature. We are prone to be ignorant of who we really are. It is very hard for us to realize that we are a brood of evil doers. Isaiah 1st chapter verse 4. The Lord said that the wickedness of man was great in the earth and that every intent of the thoughts of his heart was only evil continually. Genesis 6 chapter verse 5. Put differently, nothing from our thoughts has any worth at all. The seeds that fall on stony places show us that those who fail to admit their true selves cannot be delivered from their sins in the end, for they cannot accept these seeds deep into their hearts due to their ignorance of their true selves.